What's up guys, Pelly Popo here. Thank you very much for watching yesterday's video and commenting and leaving the support and then checking out today's video. This is gonna be a little different. I took one uh, track and I played this piano part over it. And all I did was copy the piano part eight times. And I know you only get eight plugins, but if you hold the sounds button and then go to edit instruments, and then you hold down the, uh, I'm sorry, if you hold down the sounds button and go to key ranges, once you have all your plugins, if you hold shift and arm all the tracks, you actually get another audio track or plugin, sorry. So you can have nine plugins, but the ninth plugin plays all of the eight tracks. Now you have to do that last. If you do that, you have to play all eight tracks first and then arm all tracks to get that to work. That's just how I've got it to, to, if that makes sense. So you play track one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. You run out of tracks. You hit the sounds, edit menu, or key ranges. Arm all your tracks by holding down shift and arm all. Then you can play over all the mess. It's pretty dope. I'm going to show you exactly what I mean right now. And I hope everybody's doing good. So this is track one. And I just copied track one. If you look on my board here, it just says track one. There are no other tracks. And I took this and I resampled it for 16 seconds with the probability at 68% on the on the menu list. When you hit menu and you hit list editor, all of the track one is on 68%. If you want to learn more about probability and stuff, I have a video on that you can look up polypopo probability or whatever. So check it. Let's keep unmuting these tracks and then I'll show you what I flipped it into. And it's all Fabric Pro. It's all Fabric Pro. So when I listen to like when I go to like performances at my daughter's school and I hear all the instruments come together, they're all playing the same shit with just different little hits of the instrument. So I'm like, we'll just copy out the tracks and do it that way and see if it... And it came out fire, listen. And right now it sounds kind of like, to me it sounds kind of like circus music, you know, carnival music. But... What I did, I went to my sample editor and I slowed that down. So we turned this, let's listen to it real quick. These are the chops that I got out of it. Check this out. This is a joke. Go to track 17, 18. I just sped it up a little bit. go both ways with it. You can speed it up or slow it down. I tried it slowed down, but I, I don't know. I think I liked it sped up a little bit on this one. And I just added a little bit of delay to this sample. So it... It sounds nice. It just sounds good. So we're going to listen to the original sample again. I'll unmute out the parts. I'll shut up. And then we'll drop the beat. Okay? And it's a good way to come up with an intro and then maybe throw that in as a hook and then I don't know it's just it's just it's part of the song and it's just dope it's just dope and it's a good way to lay down your original melody and be able to change it and be like here use this here use that but I'm keeping my original melody just change the probability okay let's go I'm gonna act like we just started
I think that's dope because it came from this. Which was originally just this one piano loop. Let me show you. Let's go to blank sequence, sequence three. Go to track one. If you guys get it, go, but this is dope. It's gonna play a four bar loop. I'm going to make it an 8 bar by doubling it. Set the pencil and then double it. Now it's 8 bars. If you want to practice, unhit the overdub. That's what we're going to do. I'll try to do my first eight bars calm and then my next eight bars with something else. This way when I split them, I have these with something and then these with a change up. Check it. I need something else on the high end. Maybe it can be lower. Let's see. I really don't want a bass line because when I make my sample, I want to put my bass line in after. Here we go. Six, seven, eight. It'll work, trust me. That's enough. Let's start copying tracks. Copy track one to track two. It's gonna do this. But you gotta change it to two. Copy two to three. Three to three. Copy four. Plug in four. Wait a minute. Four to four. Copy. Four to five. Five to five. Copy. Five to six. 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 Copy. Six to seven. Seven to seven. more time. Seven to eight. 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 Go to track nine. We're out of plugins. So now we go to sounds. That key ranges. Hold shift. We're going to arm all the tracks. Now I can play every instrument over so it gives me another plugin.
going to sample that. Sample it. Make sure it says sample left and right. Right now it's on one, input one. You got to scroll all the way to left and right. Arm it. Edit that. Hopefully it saved that. Hopefully this is it. one so again you can pitch it down that might be good for some like some trap or something I don't know but we're gonna go up three we're gonna trim it you can manual chop this I'm just gonna you can manual chop it but I'm gonna region it into 16 just to get it going here you guys can spend all the time you want doing that I'm not going to do that. Example one. Cool. Let's lay down this little beat here, and if we like it, we'll play it. Let's see. It should work. drop that and then we'll end this video here and it was really cool hanging out again with you guys just for fun just for the just for the fun just for the little the little fun just for the fun i don't know if that's gonna sound good let's try okay i see what happened Sample. This is the sample. <laughs> okay, let's drop that and then we'll get out of here. Slice all to negative three. sounds better original shit
Sounds good with plus three. So we made two. And one got mixed up. So let's go back to the original one we did. Pretty dope. And then we took this one as the second one we sampled. Okay, again, I just copy the tracks. You can always just go in there and make a simple little piano track. And it's dope, but I like to mess around and try different things. So that's what came out today. Kind of dope. Kind of happy with that. Right on, guys. I'm Poli Popo, and I'll see you guys on the next one. time all right guys <laughs> let's see on the next one i just wanted to end it like this i don't want to end it like the way that it just ended i want to redo it and